Gun violence is a growing concern across the U.S. and right here at home in Cleveland. And that concern is now affecting our youth. We across our city are taking an all of government approach to make sure that young people have productive things to do when they leave school. Cleveland Mayor Justin Bibbs words come on a tragic day for one family on the city's east side. Police say a 10 year old boy is dead after his aunt shot him inside his own home. News 5's Delon Dillard explains some are now calling for tougher gun laws right here in Ohio. Investigators say a 10 year old boy was shot early Monday morning in this home near 77th and St. Clair. We're told by police the boy's aunt was handling a gun and shot through the ceiling. Police say the round went through the floor of the bedroom the 10 year old was in hitting the boy in the head. Cleveland City Councilwoman Stephanie House represents the ward where the shooting happened. So it's very devastating uh, to hear the news that we lost one of Ward 7's babies. The city leader is calling for strict gun laws and training as our state eases restrictions for gun owners. You cannot highlight like the importance for those who have access to guns, whether you purchase a gun, you were gifted a gun to be properly trained know how to store them, know how to lock them up. But now next week come in Ohio, all bets are off. House is referencing Ohio's recently signed permitless carry bill. Starting next week, Ohioans 21 and older can carry a concealed firearm without any training or background checks. And Monday, Cleveland Mayor Justin Bibb telling ABC News that he is not happy about it. So it's making it harder for me as a mayor of Cleveland to keep our streets safe day in and day out. But back in March, Rob Sexton with the Buckeye Firearms Association told News 5 the legislation protects families. You may not have time to go get a permit or to go through all the background check or the classes or the training. According to the Health Policy Institute of Ohio, between 1999 and 2020, there's been a 123% increase in homicides, and the majority of them are gun-related. While police are not calling Monday shooting a homicide, that 10 year old's aunt is under arrest and Bibb says more concealed guns on the street will not make things easier as we move forward. I'm a Democratic mayor uh, in a red state. Uh, Governor DeWine right here in Ohio just gave us a grant today of over nearly $2 million to address violence prevention in my city. But we have to do a better job of making sure these Republicans know how hard it is to keep our city safe with these very dangerous gun laws. In Cleveland, Delon Dillard, News 5.